Stop. If you're not already subscribed, hit that big red button down below. Turn on, uh, click on that gray bell, turn on notifications, drop a like on this video, and leave any comments suggesting any year nays, topics, or anything. Do you know the origins of Halloween? Well, I think I know it's like it used to be like some European in Ireland or something maybe, or like pagan, I don't know, where like they gave, they dressed up as ghosts or like dead people. Well, Here's, well, yeah, they would, like, you're onto something. Like, they would, there's even further back, but, like, yeah. one aspect of Drew film was in European culture sometimes during All Hallows' Eve, they would, people would go around uh, begging for food, and uh, that and that's, like, the where trick-or-treating is supposed yeah. to come from, and people would be given stuff called soul cakes. Spooky, isn't it? <laughs> soul cakes. But, yeah, I think the origin it has roots from a very, uh, I think, Celtic holiday. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pronounce this wrong. I know it. Samhain. S-A-M-H-A-I-N. I know that's not pronounced wrong, but it's a, it's a holiday that celebrates. It's kind of like uh, El Dia de los Muertos, and it's mm -hmm. celebrating the dead. Yeah. And there's rituals and stuff like that, where, and it involves fire, wearing costumes and masks, which is where, you know, we're, how we wear dressing up comes yeah. from. So, yeah, that's where, it's not exactly like it, but it's not, it's not like, and I don't know if it's still celebrated around the world, but yeah, Halloween has gotten a lot of roots from that. You know, now they turned it into a way to make money, honestly. I mean, yeah, the candy, just, the costumes. Market. It's just good for the overall economy, though. Yeah, so the like, candy, the costumes, go. like, the amusement parks, the pumpkin patches, the, like, it's just a whole different market. Yeah, like, and I think... I don't know how it, it, it. I'm just surprised, like stuff from that long ago is influ has like developed into still what influence is Halloween. Yeah. It's still influencing Halloween. Here, I'll pull up some other stuff because there's a lot to I, I try to read and I yeah have forgotten. A lot. All Saints Day is another thing that Halloween comes from. Here, it's a uh, I think yeah, Sunshine and All Saints Day. They're both religious stuff, and Halloween is definitely not religious anymore. So. I definitely think that that's interesting. Yeah, look, it but... dates back to the Celtic festival of Samhain. Somain. Som Somain? They call it Somain. Yeah, November 1st. But yeah, Som Somain. Somain. Bro, I, I was so off with that pronunciation. Oh my Somain. god. So, uh, Celtics lived 2,000 years ago, mostly in the area. Now Ireland, the United Kingdom... North France celebrated their new year on November 1st. Oh, okay. So look, um, uh, Halloween came. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's some weird traditions though. Like I was seeing one about how Halloween is like a matchmaking holiday where, uh, here young women identify their future husbands by it through a matchmaking cook, which buries rings and their food on Halloween night, hoping to bring true love to the diner who found the ring so that'd be that's pretty cool. a match fade in heaven it's an interesting concept but i just it just sounds like crazy like nowadays finding your that. soulmate yeah. Ooh, that easily i mean yeah finding everyone wants to find their soulmate but yeah. that just seems like i mean people believed in a lot of things back then and that isn't honestly that isn't too surprising so one is also I don't know, from what I've read, people seeing it as a dark, like, there's dark magic, yeah, dark rituals. Yeah, it's it's like more of a stigma. It's a thousand-year-old uh, yeah. celebration, so it's like... It's, I mean, without it, we wouldn't have Halloween, so we gotta, yeah, we gotta think. Maybe we would've gotten there, but, like, yeah, without it... I mean, this whole, like, fall season, yeah, it's the winter... Let's click on the link real quick before we're... We're about to end soon, but yeah. see if there's anything we want to add. About someone? Trick or treat? Trick or treat, I'll show it. Trick or treat, um, <laughs> uh, trick. Trick, uh, hundred percent. I've never done a trick, but I'd like to. Like I said earlier. Uh, uh yeah. I mean, I took my thumbs. Okay, this is all. This is all Bill's trick, guys. Yes, okay. yes. And you guys owe me candy now. <laughs> all right. Well, oh yeah. Here's before we end. Black cats on Halloween. I think. Oh. The, the stigma with black cats is that. There, people used to think that witches. Bad luck. Big, why they're bad luck is yeah. because people used to think witches hit as black cats. So, oh, and witches, you don't want to get to curse you, right? So yeah. they're considered bad luck. You know, we have two bad black. You click on we black have, cats and ghosts on Halloween. Bro, we have two black cats in our backyard. Like two, they're just double the bad luck for yeah. you. Okay? <laughs> I know.
<laughs> Bro, I walked into, like, you know how you walk, they say don't walk through a ladder or, like, under a ladder? Yeah. I did that and, I like, was thinking about it for, like, the rest of the day. Because, like, it's I like... I mean, Halloween, I, bad luck, they're one in the... They're, they're a lot of Halloween has black been, luck, uh, bad luck stuff has stemmed from Halloween. Yeah. But, 